We're very excited because we've discovered a new population of cells that regulate the immune response. If we know some of the ways that the body naturally blocks an immune response, the idea would be that we could target this particular cell population. So you can imagine using an approach to target these bad guys that block the immune response, but at the same time come in with another approach that will augment the immune response. And in this way, um, this, this will really strengthen the ability of people to treat cancer using immune therapy. So what we're providing by identifying this population of cells is one, the idea that we can provide personalized medicine when we know these cells are there or not in, in cancer patients. That, that's one thing. The second thing is it, it provides a target for pharmaceutical companies to, to work towards. So if we could identify new drugs that would kill off this population, then that also would augment an immune response and, and unleash the immune response against the tumors. So we hope one day that this, our findings will be applied to clinical trials and help patients, help them with their cancer treatment, help guide uh, different therapies. I think the timelines for this happening really depend on how lucky we are in identifying ways to track these cells and learn more about these cells. I'm Pam Ohashi, Director of the Tumor Immunotherapy Program at the Princess Margaret Cancer Centre.